Hey everybody, AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119. So we have an Ameritron AL811H, belongs to a ham down in the Carolinas. So, he bought this thing, new, from 1993. It's an oldie. I like the older ones better. So, I did the revisions to it. The bias mod that they do over here is a uh, voltage divider. They feed back to the center tap of the transformer for the filament. I cut the trace. Normally they just ground the center tap on the older ones to bias the tubes on. I put the string of diodes in there. I changed the SO239 connectors with tough uh, gold plated center conductor Teflon dielectric. The old ones had no grip on a new PL259 connector. I had to replace two of the sockets. The clips are messed up on one. Uh, had the grid loading resistors when it flashed. I don't know where the other socket went, but yeah, I'll clean this. I promise. <laughs> Here are the old grid loading resistors. So, grounded the grids, put the gas discharge tubes in. Someone put a parasitic board in at some point. Had a highest BR on 10 meters, so ended up taking out the hunter puff cap. I accessed the back of it from the panel. I took this panel off where you go from 120 to 220. And uh, I was able to get at it with my soldering iron, but unfortunately it was not that one. That was within tolerance. I changed it anyway. It's Hunter Puff. It was the one over here below. So I had to take the shaft out again because this all came out originally to, you know, do the work underneath there. And so I ended up taking the shaft out again, undid all the screws, connections over here, and got the cap out. So it's supposed to be 180 puff. It was actually a 120. So swapped it out with a 180. Now she's good. Now nice flat SBR on uh, 10 meters. Works on all bands. Air, var air variables look good. The meter protection diode's good. Meter lamps work. And uh, she's good to go. Clean the contacts on the bias slash TR relay and the contacts on the rotary switches with Deoxic Gold. Awesome stuff. Has a brand new set of Pentalab tubes. Awesome company. Can't say enough good stuff about them. So, that's that. Amplifier is ready to rock and roll. If you need an amplifier repaired, feel free to give me a call. 203-892-4119. That's amprepairguy.com. Once again, 203-892-4119. And I am back to work on the 6 meter monster. Right there. So... See you guys soon. Take care.